We're back at the Ferris Center at the University of Central Arkansas, and it should be a great one tonight. There's another good crowd on hand. The guy the fans come out to see, and probably the most outstanding basketball player in the Arkansas Intercollegiate Conference is the Bears Center, Scotty Pippen. 68-56, Bears lead. They get it to Pippen on the breakaway. <laughs> Just the story of Scotty Pippen is pretty remarkable. Uh, someone that came to school here to be a manager on our basketball team and then grows seven inches, you know, between his freshman year and his probably junior year and, and becomes an All-American basketball player. I was wanting to get the opportunity to play at an NCAA school, so I spoke to a few teams and you know, I sit back and thought that Scotty Pippen wouldn't have been a Scotty Pippen at another school. I'd have just been another player. Right now, I have the opportunity playing in the NBA. Have you met Michael Jordan yet? Uh, no, I haven't met him, but I think that when we get the chance to meet up, that we're going to work together. Scotty on the drive, beats Vinny Johnson with a behind the back move. Left corner, Jordan, Michael Fire. Three, go! How do you feel about being back in Arkansas, and uh, how much has your life changed in the last couple of weeks since you've won the championship? Well, I, I feel great. I mean, it's always great to come back home and see your friends. It's a great story, you know, and it doesn't happen frequently, but it tells you that it can happen, and it can happen anywhere. Our men's basketball coaches asked me, can we name the court after Scottie Pippen? They were like, well, we're gonna be fully ESPN compliant moving forward, and we think it would be great for us as a university to highlight the fact that Scottie Pippen went to school here every time we have a game. And we wanna have a Scottie Pippen camp. We just wanna get him back in the fold. We think this would be good for our program and recruiting. And so it just worked out perfectly to have his signature and name on this court. You know, we had 250 campers here on our court and it's a Monday morning you know we all said a few words and when we introduced Scotty um, you know his head coach Don Dyer had passed away recently so we didn't realize but he had all these pent-up emotions inside and, and when he started discussing the fact that his alma mater had named their basketball court after him he really delivered a, a great heartfelt speech <laughs> Coach Dyer philosophy helped me a great deal because I feel that it was him that made me. He gave me the opportunity. And it was up to me to make the best of it. To be a part of the University of Central Arkansas, it was a dream for me to play in the NBA, to have the opportunity to play college ball. This university gave me the opportunity. And the guy in my life. This is my family. Thank you.